Hey YouTube, Jeep and Bubba here, coming at you with April's updates and events. Got a lot going on in April and I wanted to get ahead of that earlier in the month and let you know about everything that we're going to be going to and what we're going to be doing this month. So just getting that information out to you. Uh, here at the shop, I'm at Black Brown Road. We have been swamp slammed, just straight up covered up. Um, responding to folks a little bit slower than normal because I've actually been out in the shop um, working on a, a seven inch lift, long arm 42s for customers. It's gonna turn out awesome, but it requires a lot of my attention. And uh, so it's uh, taking me a little bit of time to get back to some folks. So just be aware we are busy right now. We're still booking people out. April's just about booked. And we're so blessed to have so much business coming in. We're excited about it. We wanna take care of people in a quick fashion. And we're working on some things to get into maybe a larger space and get some more guys in. and. Working on a way to do a retail space as well for you guys. But uh, all that's to come. We won't worry about that right now. We're about what's going on. So this weekend, I'm headed up to Turkey Bay with Adventure Russ and my buddy Johnny, Avery Jackson, and uh, Avery Jackson are riding, and then uh, our buddy David Vining and his TJ. Um, so we're going to have four rigs up there. We thought about making this a bigger event, bringing a lot more folks, but one, I've never wheeled there. Two, I haven't wheeled my Jeep since I did the upgrades on it. I want to film some drone shots. I want to get some video stuff in. Um, I just didn't want to drive six hours with a large group of folks, get up there just to potentially break or wrench or have to film for a while. And then we're only going to go up. Um, we're driving up Saturday and uh, camping, and then Sunday we're wheeling, and then driving back Sunday. So it's a quick event. We're going to get familiar with the area, then we're going to do another event where we bring everyone back. So those that didn't, go on, didn't get to go on this event, don't worry, we're going to do another event. Of course, you can always go on your own, but we'll learn a little bit about the area and, and we'll bring it back where we do some kind of uh, public ride. We put it out there and we'll bring a group up there and have a good time. So we're, I'm sure we're not going to be able to see everything there is up there in uh, about the six or seven hours we'll have to wheel. But looking forward to getting the badge and um, getting out there and enjoying the place. So um, looking forward to that and uh, we'll do a video on that. That'll be next week's video. We'll definitely try to get some film shots for you, and we'll see how Blue Jeep 2.0 does. Now, there's a lot left to do on Blue Jeep 2.0. I got some new Empower lights. You might peep the shirt I'm wearing today. They gave me five of these, so you're going to see me wearing them quite a bit. Uh, I love wearing black shirts to work in. But uh, Empower is a silicone lighting company. They make these things indestructible, and they've sent me some of their new facial lights, which I'm going to use as rock lights. Some of their pods and then a really really cool light bar that's an interior light bar you might have seen something like it before these guys invented it and they make an awesome product um going to be a brand ambassador for them you might have seen that posted on social media so i'm looking forward to get this stuff installed so we'll make sure we make a video on that as well and we need to have that done before jeep beach which is coming up but before we talk about jeep beach we got even more events going on so this month the next event from from today, the beginning of April, whenever you see this, will be that we're going to have um, Scottles and Bottles on the 16th. Now, I'm trying to make it work that I'll be at Scottles and Bottles, but I did promise the Big Canoe Jeep Club I'd teach an off-road class that day. So um, if I'm not able to do both or I'm not able to reschedule one or the other, I may not be at this Scottles and Bottles. The theme this month is Land Cruiser, but we hope to be there. Um, we love going down to that show. Whether we're there or not, go check it out. And it's a monthly Overland show down at Sweetwater Brewery. So check it out. This month it's going to be on the 16th. Um, we have it listed in our Black Bear Off-Road Trail team. If you're looking for events and you're on Facebook, you need to go to Facebook and check out the group called Black Bear Off-Road Trail Team. We've got almost 900 people in it right now, and we're posting events all the time in there. So um, check it out. We've got a big list right now. Then going to the 20th, that's April 20th, uh, we're going to be at, back at On the Border. We haven't been there since last year. We'll be back at On the Border. Uh, they've got the awesome, awesome taco bar. It's cheap. They've got good deals on margaritas. We're on the patio. We park right by the patio. The weather's nice. It's a good time to go out and hang out on the patio and on the border at the Mall of Georgia. We'll be there on the 20th, starting at 6.30 p.m., um, and we hope to see you there. We'll be back at Johnny's Pizza May 3rd. Not doing a Johnny's Pizza this month. Just got way too much going on, so we're going to take a break there. But as, um, as far as once may hits we'll be running two jeep nights per month one in swanee one in buford so one's going to be a wednesday nights in, in swanee uh, i'm going to try to do it the first week of the month the first wednesday of the month and then the third thursday 
So uh, I'll post all this in the trail team, but if you're not on Facebook, then just know um, May 3rd and April 20th, uh, April 20th on the border mall, Georgia, May 3rd at Johnny's Pizza in Swanee, that's Peachtree Industrial and McGinnis Ferry. Um, and both of those are at 6.30 p.m. We'll see you there. Then, um, moving on, there will be Jeep Beach. And we're going to be closed here starting Wednesday the 26th. We'll be down at the Show and Shine the 26th at Destination 4x4's uh, place. Thursday night, we'll be at Ormond Garage for the Bruiser, um, their opening night uh jeep night kind of thing it's a really cool event down there at ormond garage uh, which is a brewery and uh thursday will be on the beach we're down um if you want to find us we're down by um the shores where they used to host everything sorry if you hear the ratcheting in the background they're working on an lj today um we'll be down by the shores which is um where's that towards towards port orange a little bit but still on daytona beach shores so just look at the shores. We're two houses down from that on the right. We're going to have, or we're staying with, um, well, we're all together in one house, us and S3 Magazine. So there's going to be two or three tents on the beach that say S3 Magazine, Black Bear Off-Road. You'll see our Jeeps parked out there. And we'll be out there Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Thursday, I'll be there all day at the beach. Friday, I'm going to go to the show at Daytona. Uh, and we'll be at the show all day. Probably just go out to eat with the family Friday night. Um, and then, uh, Saturday, we're just going to be relaxing at the beach. Nothing too crazy there. Then we usually get breakfast Sunday morning and head back. If you live in the area uh, up here in North Georgia or central Georgia, and you want to convoy down with us, we're going to be meeting Wednesday morning. Um, I would say it's going to be hard to tell you this time perfectly, but we're trying to leave this area pretty early um i'd say eight o'clock so we'll be down at the making bucky's around 10 uh again if you're on facebook just look for that because i'm gonna make that as a as an event that we're gonna go down from the bucky's there um probably meet about 10 10 30 dm me if if you want to or email me info blackbearoffroad.com remember on that email it's info at blackbearoff-road.com um, hit me up and you can convoy down with us if you're going to Jeep Beach. And if you're going, let's get together, hang out, drink a beer, hang out at one of the events, meet us on the beach. Let's do something. If you've never gone before, you don't know what it is. It's the largest uh, event in our area other than Jeep Invasion and Pigeon Forge. And this one's down at the beach where you can drive up and down the beach. You can go to the vendor's uh, event inside the infield of the Daytona 500. It's absolutely a great time. Um, you know, they've got an obstacle course there if you want to do some wheeling, but really it's more of hanging out, getting together, chilling on the beach, very relaxed. It's a good family vacation, uh, and that's where we'll be at at the end of this month. And again, going into May, we have Johnny's Pizza, and I'll be putting together some more events as we go into May. I'd like to do either a trail cleanup or some kind of ride where we can all get back together and ride. It's been a few months, um, and we'll try to put something together like that in the month of May. And um, we'll be doing, as far as videos go on this channel, you're going to see our Turkey Bay ride. You're going to see us do these Empower lights. Now I've got to do some Adams drive shaft, these Empower lights. I've got a switch panel to put on. Um, and I think I owe you guys a walk around a Blue Jeep, a walk around on my trailer. So we're going to get those videos coming to you. And of course, we'll film another video down at Jeep Beach. Do me a favor, if you guys are automotive enthusiasts, check out the S3 app. It's S3 Magazine's app. They've gone from doing the print magazine to their app. Now, I write articles for them. My buddy Dave writes articles for him. Of course, Jonathan Woolley, whose Jeep we built here, writes and owns the company. He's one of the co-owners. Him and the other co-owner and their uh, apparel guy, Frank, will all be down staying with us at the house in Daytona. So they're making a big push to put off-road in Jeep into their app and magazine but they also post a ton of great automotive stuff whether you're looking on youtube TikTok, uh but of course on their app as well and they've got some really cool swag so check that out um and uh, look for me to be writing some more articles for them i'm gonna be bringing back the podcast in april i've got a few people that want to get interviewed a few folks that i want to interview 
And I want—I got a lot of stuff I want to talk to you guys about. Just been super busy with this place. April's probably our busiest month. Not probably. April's our busiest month here at the shop. And we're going to be on full-on crunch to get Jeep Beach ready. Um, we got Project Liberty Max. That's the one we built last year for Jeep Beach. It's getting some new paint put on it. We just put some new seats in it. Um, tons of new audio in it. And we're going to be putting new bumpers and bigger springs on it. And I can't wait to see it down at Jeep Beach. That'll be towards the end of this month. A last little minute crash so to speak putting it all together finishing up my jeep and that'll be about it that's just about it sorry i got a delivery from o'reilly's four pounds of grease <laughs> anyways guys i hope you guys have a fantastic april let me know if we can do anything for you here at the shop we got a few days left uh, if you need any parts hit me up i'll be glad to ship them to you or you come pick them up here at the shop got a little bit of hoodies left they're on sale check them out on our website blackbarrelfroad.com just got a few left and they're marked down we'll be doing some new swag probably in april maybe may i got some stickers coming some things like that so just hit me up if you need anything if you're gonna be at g beach let's get together and um you know we'll be down on the beach chilling if you can find me i got a free beer for you um and maybe a sticker or a koozie or something like that but Come hang out with us. That should be a good time. And uh, let's do some wheeling. Hopefully everything goes good at Turkey Bay with the Jeep and all that. Like I say, April's kind of a crazy month for us. Um, but we're going to try to get together with folks at the Jeep night head on the border. We'll put some stuff together. Maybe we can go back riding together as well. Um, I know that a lot of folks just want to get out there and hit the trails. And uh, we'd be glad to, to do that with you as well. So hope there's an adventure in your future. Eat your prunes. I'm Jeep and Bubba. We'll be seeing you.